Memphis is also after that uh, you know the knee jerk reaction now is at 469 remember blackstone has checked in and this is not an equity infusion what blackstone is doing is that blackstone is really picking up hp hp stake in uh, in emphasis so blackstone is confident that since they have a large uh, group and they have expertise of understanding the current uh, demand of the global uh, you know demand of companies and their it needs they will be able to really inject a fresh lease of life for emphasis so the way i look at emphasis that it is not just an ordinary deal of capital infusion it is a deal where a pe player which is uh, which has access to a mass it market will now come on board and they will like to turn, turn it around and you know neeraj i think that's the point which we really need to understand i mean blackstone is coming on board because they it's not that emphasis needs money blackstone is coming on board because blackstone is confident of turning the business around mm -hmm. i mean emphasis is a sizable company a billion dollar company and uh, this is not a p investment in a real estate firm or p investment in a startup this is where a large p investor is coming in because they feel confident that from the existing network and their understanding of the it environment in this complex world is going to be easy and they will be able to monetize that on the emphasis platform that's my understanding i mean we should not just treat this as a as in capital infusion mm. and the stock of course has changed course from yesterday it was i mean largely subdued to the stock is high by about 4% uh, 472 as we speak himang how do you uh, view uh, the road ahead for emphasis from here because you know like nikanj pointed out they have a strong hold in bfsi uh, and with blackstone's kind of client exposure that can expand we don't have a stock under coverage but the only limited point that i want to make is that <clears throat> this is not an ordinary private equity investor coming into the you know company it is more like a strategic investor which is trying to build a model and which is trying to build a good revenue visibility for the company and remember that they also have some kind of an assurance coming from hp for a certain kind of a you know business growth for next about 5 years or so so coupled with that i think there is going to be some kind of a re-rating that one can really look at also it will involve some kind of an open offer so there is going to be some kind of an excitement uh, that we will see for a stock like emphasis okay well uh, you got a new kid on the block a new opening and let's hear out from the management of equitas holdings <laughs> 